like this video and subscribe to the channel if you love mom and dad. JJ hold them down. They stole our diamonds. We need to put them back. Hey you thieves put everything back or I'll call the police. Run! Oh no Mikey. They're wiping us out with a bow. But we don't have any weapons with us. They are much stronger than us. Without guns, we're nothing. Yippee! No, 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 no! Mikey, I got hit a little bit by this bandit with an arrow right in my arm. But that won't stop me, I'll still get our diamonds back. Maybe you should go to the hospital. I'll try to stop them on my own. No thanks, I'm fine. Oh no, they run away through the stairs. I hope you called the police beforehand and they came and waited for them at the top. You two put your hands over your head and come down slowly so I can see you, mister. Mikey, did you call the police? We grabbed those thugs at the exit. Good thing you called us. Oh, shit. What happened to your friend? These bandits poisoned him by throwing some kind of potion right on him, he started choking. It was like he didn't have enough oxygen. But so far he has a pulse, but he's still breathing badly and we need to get him to the hospital right away. Two hours later. Doctor, did you examine JJ? How is he doing? Is he going to live? He's been very badly poisoned and can't breathe. It's very hard to say anything right now. He's unconscious. First of all, he lost a lot of blood, he has a wound on his arm, and apparently, besides the lack of air, someone else shot him. Can you tell us what happened? I have to write up a report about it and turn it in to the police. We and my friend were robbed by bandits and stole our diamonds. We ran after them and started to catch them, well, to take their diamonds. But at some point the bandit shot his bow and arrow hit JJ's hand, he took it out and went on. Why at the stairs a potion was thrown at him and he began to suffocate, that's how it all happened in a detailed step. I understand you, the operation is about to take place, you need to wait at the door. The guy's JJ is about to have surgery, they told me to wait outside. When the surgery is over I'll be called to JJ's. I'm going to rest for a while. A few moments later. What time is it now? I wonder how JJ is doing. Go, go, go! Yippee! You won! Blah, blah, blah! Doctor. I see that the operation was a success and that JJ is alive and well. The only question is why is he in a wheelchair and not on his feet? He'll have to sit on it for a couple more days. Because the surgery was very serious. And he can't move his body temporarily until it's healed properly. I suggest you spend more time outdoors. Good morning, you're finally awake. I'm tired of listening to you snore. You do it so loud. Sorry, I'll try not to snore anymore or I'll do it quietly. No, 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 no! We need a shotgun or a gun of some kind. Listen, do we happen to have? I can't say for sure, because I was looking for the gun the other day and didn't find it there. We have to look at home in the trunk, maybe there is. There's only money, no sword or gun, unfortunately. But we have an advantage, we have money to buy with. Run! Yippee!
Hey bro, we need some good weapons for the zombies. To kill them with one bullet or stun them though. I'd like that very much. Hi, unfortunately I can't give you a real gun. You are not allowed to use it and you don't have a permit. I can offer you two swords and one bow and arrow. Anything I have, I'll give it back. few moments later we had already approached the place before that the inhabitants went down and the zombies followed them i'm a little worried just according to the legend of this township if a zombie scratches or bites you the venom will instantly coat your body and you could die quickly yeah i heard that too it's probably true but you have to be careful don't let anybody bite be careful mikey okay there's a little parkour here I think we're going the right way, there's only one. Blah, blah, blah! You won! <laughs> Run! Oh shit, the door is closed. We need a lever. See if there's anything in the trunk. Maybe there's a lockpick of some kind. The inhabitants go upstairs, there are stairs. It leads to the center of the village, but a very narrow cave. Try to fit in. Yahoo! Amen! do anything for JJ's sake. I've made up my mind, I'm going to give him my life. He's always helped me, now it's my turn. Two hours later. <laughs> what? No, 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 no! <laughs> hey JJ, it's good that you're awake. We have to go fishing now, I hope you haven't forgotten. Hi, no, of course not. How could I forget about fishing? It's my favorite hobby. I have a feeling we're going to catch a lot of fish today. Alright, Mr. Fisherman, here's your rod and let's go to the pond. Cool, thanks bro. Look at how beautiful the weather is today. It's the coolest time to go fishing, I personally think. I agree with you completely, as long as it doesn't rain. Yahoo! Yippee! Mikey, there's nobody by the pond. It looks like the residents are all resting today. Usually there were a lot of people here and no places to fish. Last week on Sunday when you went to the supermarket to get groceries. I went fishing and there were about 20 people here and they were all fishing together and there was no room at all for me. Ah! 
Mikey, how are you feeling? Are you okay? That monster came out of the cave and bit you. Should we see a doctor? I think I'm fine. Nothing hurts, and I don't need a doctor. Run! Oh, I don't feel good, JJ. I guess that monster left some kind of poison in me. Help me. We need to call an ambulance. Mikey is unconscious. A few moments later. So with Mikey, what predictions do you make? Of course, it's a little early to make a prognosis, he's unconscious now. And his pulse is not stable, tell me what happened to him? My friend and I woke up early in the morning and went fishing at the back pond. We're standing there, fishing, and then a monster comes out of a cave and bites Mikey, and Mikey falls into the water. That's how it happened. I hear you, wait for the results. Unfortunately we lose it, if we don't find a new heart jersey dies in an hour. Doctors, I think I found the heart, now you need to take my heart and give it to Mikey. Excuses are not accepted, I say you do. One hour later. What am I doing here? Doctor, why am I in the hospital? Mr. Mikey, your operation was a success. Your heart almost stopped, but your friend JJ donated his heart for you. Mikey get him, he's running away and he's got stolen money in his hands and needs to give it back to the girl. Run! Where could he have gone? He ran this way, there's no other way. No, 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 no! your money and don't lose it again we caught the thief boy thank you so much what would i do without you you are my heroes jj let's go to the woods we still have to go get some firewood it's supposed to get cold tonight so we need to be prepared to stay warm JJ I found an underground entrance under a tree, I was chopping wood and found this. Run! No God! No God please no! 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 Mikey you found the secret lab, you're good, it's not legal. Ha ha ha!
Mikey here you just hang in there. I will take you to the doctors and they will examine you as soon as possible. Doctor, doctor, please help my friend. Your friend was very badly hurt, can you explain? What happened to you and him, you have scars on your head too. My friend and I found a secret lab and there we were attacked by zombies and very badly maimed. These are all wounds and broken bones from the zombies. I hear you, Mr. JJ but you'll have to wait outside the door, while the operation is being performed. Okay. I think I'll get some sleep. <sighs> Two hours later. <laughs> Doctor, thank you so much for your help. Here's your money for your work. If it wasn't for you, Mikey would have died. Doctor help me, my kids are sick and on the verge of death. Sorry, we don't have the right vaccine, and the kids need a new heart. We don't have it and we can't provide it, sorry we can't help. Take your time doctor, Mikey and I are willing to sacrifice our hearts. For the sake of these little ones, we will give our lives. What? 